Today's weekly Red Dead Online update is the best weekly Red Dead Online update ever, personally for me. Why? Well, because check my nickname, it says only PvP cat. You see, PvP, and you know what, PvP in Red Dead Online is a total joke. No matchmaking system, overpowered tonics, imbalanced ability cards, no balance between different weapons. But today most of these problems were fixed, not for long, probably only for one week. But we find Finally got the PvP showdown series that most of PvP players were asking for since the first day of Red Dead Online. No tonics, no ability cards, no auto aiming. It's it's is just awesome. And by the way, even if you're not a big fan of PvP in general, I still suggest you to try this new featured series, because it seems like there are extra payouts this week and you can earn a lot of gold. But also there are other stuff in today's weekly Red Dead Online update, such as discounts, new legendary animals and new emotes. Let me tell you about it pretty quick. First of all, I wasn't able to find any new clothing this week, but there are some new emotes. And they look pretty fun, I mean, maybe I will even buy some of them. Anyway, just letting you know that there are some new emotes. Discounts. This week you can buy any tonic from Crazy Woman with 40% discount. And yeah, sometimes I call her a woman despite the fact that she's a bitch, that's just what she is. I mean, some people were saying in the comments, wow, I found her attractive and sexy, but boy, you are in a big trouble if you find a woman like that attractive, like really in a big trouble. Anyway, tonics. Well, mostly they are useless, but you gonna need them for daily challenges, so maybe with this discount you can buy some of them. Next discount is 30% for all the garment sets that Gus is selling and for all the trinkets. By the way, if you wanna know about the trinkets, check my guide, link will be in the description. I'm gonna buy a lot of garment sets with this discount. But I have to find some legendary animals first. Speaking of legendary animals, two new legendary animals this week, legendary bugs. You can check where to find them using in-game legendary animal map or using interactive Red Dead Online map. By the way, this week there is a 50% extra payouts for these bugs blood samples and Gus will also pay you 50% more for their pelts and carcasses. Personally, I won't even try to hunt them this week, because first of all, Last week I have absolutely no luck finding legendary coyotes, that's probably because legendary animal spawns are again broken for me, but there is even more important reason. New PvP Showdown Series. So let's talk about it. I'm gonna tell you what this new feature Showdown Series is about, what's the rules for this showdown mode and why it's so awesome. But before we begin, here is some more information about weekly Red Dead Online that I have to mention. First of all, new wildlife photographer free roam event. I haven't tried it yet and I'm not quite sure whether it's gonna be my favorite free roam event, but just letting you know. Also during this week completing any free roam event will grant you 100 Red Dead Online dollars and if you gonna take any photo using the new advanced camera, you also gonna receive 100 Red Dead Online dollars. Now let's talk about new PvP modes that can be found in the featured showdown series. Basically Basically it's a hardcore mode, no ability cuts, no consumables, it means no tonics and no food that can fortify your statuses. And by the way, anyone has the same amount of health, stamina and dead eye, despite the fact that you're not gonna be able to use dead eye in this mode anyways. And weapons are the same for anyone, and to be honest it's not the best weapons in the game. Leechfield repeater and Schofield revolver, and pump action shotgun but it's fine. But the most important, no auto aiming. Finally, the there is a mode where anyone is equal. I mean, not anyone is equal because anyone has a different skill, but anyone starts in the same condition and high level who's drinking tonics and spending a lot of money in this game mode is not gonna have any sort of advantage over new player. And it's awesome, it's just something that I always wanted to see in Red Dead Online's PvP. Anyway, so far I've seen few game modes, most wanted, overrun and hostile territory. 
and even hostile territory with these rules is kinda fun mode, because you cannot just paint it black anyone and kill them with one bow shot from across the map. Personally I enjoyed all of these game modes, but of course most wanted is my favorite. I had a lot of fun playing in this new game mode, because for the first time in Red Dead Online I had a feeling that to win I actually have to show some skill. Because previously it was more about the weapons that I'm using, ability cards that I'm using, and the fact that I can afford unlimited amount of tonics, which most of the participants cannot do because of the low level and limited funds. And now it's all about you and your ability to aim, and that's awesome and perfect. I'm definitely gonna play a lot of hardcore game modes this week, and hopefully after this week they not gonna remove it forever. After I will earn some experience in a new mode, I will probably make some tips and tricks video about it. But there are a few fast tips that I want to share with you right now. First of all, remember, if you wanna restore your health, there are health restoration here and there on the map. You can find it by this white heart on your minimap. And second important note, try to change your default weapons, especially Lichfield Repeater, to some other weapon. Pretty much any weapon is much better than the Lichfield Repeater, especially Karkana Rifle, it's overpowered here. I mean it's overpowered anywhere, but here especially. Anyway guys, I guess it's time for me to go practice in this new PvP mode, to learn something and to share this knowledge with you. I hope that you was glad to see this weekly update as much as I was, but even if you're not a PvP guy, there are still some good discounts and, you know, new legendary animals. So I hope you enjoyed this video, thank you for watching, до свидания.